what's up guys danny here for do tech and welcome back with another video i'm gonna be taking a look right now and showing you guys about how you can download the houdini alpha into your i device which is going to be compatible right now for the ios 10.3.1 and 10.3.2 at that moment is not working for the 10.3.3 but i hope that's going to be work in the near future so let's go ahead and get it started Okay, so basically the link will be for you guys in the description down below. That's if you want to download the Dini app into your iDevice. So I'm going to be leave that link for you guys that when you open it, it's going to be taking you right away to Houdini website. Make sure after that, all what you need to do to download the IPA file. So go ahead and click on uh, the download here. And once you're done from that, save the IPA file into your desktop so you can easily reach it from there. And once you're done from that, as you know, you need to get the CD Impactor in order to download the app into your iDevice. So go ahead and launch the CD Impactor and make sure you download the last version of CD Impactor. And that's going to be also in a link down below. So once you're done, all what you need to do right now, just drag and drop that IP file into your CD Impactor. And go ahead right now and just add your Apple ID and your password and it's going to be work right away and download the app into your iDevice. Once you're done from that, I'm going to be jump right now into the device and showing you guys what to do from there. Okay, so when you're back to the device, you're going to be see the Houdini app into your iDevice and all what you need to do right now, you need to go back hitting the settings under the settings to general and you need to trust the app before you launch it. Once you're done from that, all what you need to do, just go ahead and launch the app. So what you need to do right now, is just go ahead and tap on start. That's going to be prepare the device. And once you uh, launch the app, that's going to be giving you even the version of your iPhone. So as you guys can see right now, I'm running 10.3.1 on this device and it might is going to be cause some issue when you want to launch the app that's going to be asking you to respring or reboot your device all right so once you're there and once you reach the home page of the Houdini this is how it's going to be looks like and then also we have the tools here in the bottom so this is where you can switch and this is where you can add and i'm going to be showing you guys and giving you guys like a basic information about how you can use it so basically this is the home page here and this is if that's if you want to go ahead and uh, add if you tap on the plus here that's going to be easily make you to add some sources just like cedia the same uh, same thing and uh, if i top here and i want to go right now to the packages here so we have two different packages right now so basically most of the packages that i see right now is not uh, compatible with the most of the 64-bit devices also most of the packages right now that's because we're still on the beta status it's also for the iphone or the ios uh, 5 or the I ios 6 so most of the packages that we have here is not working most of them it's old but uh, also i'm going to be giving you guys a link that's going to be pretty much explain every single thing in what uh, package is right now available and you can uh, download it and uh, also you can read most of the stuff about how you can use also the semi jailbreak and if we jump right now to the other section so that's going to be giving you guys uh, some other tweaks you can call it so this is for the screen resolution here and then also for the icon labels we have the icon 3d and also we have the seri here the passcode button uh, customize and then also we have the icon budget so easily if you want to just stop off on one of them that's going to be for the ipad so that's going to be giving you a heads up if uh, you running the temp 10.3.1 or the 10.3.2 on your older ipad that's the semi jailbreak is going to be work so once you top on the ipad you want to choose the iphone go ahead and just apply and raise a prank and then also if you're looking to pay for the apps that's going to be in the near future because it's not available right now so you can download dipped here and then also if you want to remove any theme or any other tweak you can just easily download uh, remove it actually from here 
so uh, this is basically how you can use it and, and as i told you guys if you want to take a look at it and then if you want to know which one is going to be available right now how you can download it as i told you guys there is a link that i'm going to be leave for you guys in the description down below that link is going to be explain everything for you and it also is going to be telling you which package is available right now and you can download it so i already download a theme on my iDevice and this is going to be the milkshake i already download this one and once i download it the only thing that i see has been different on my icons which is going to be just the youtube app and i didn't see anything the different it might be the facebook app as well and this is the only thing so as i told you guys most of the things is not available yet but once the uh we pass the beta status and once we see the final release for that semi jailbreak which is houdini i think you will be see a lot of tweaks which is going to be compatible for your i device so this is pretty much most of the stuff that i have for you guys i try to just giving you guys a basic information about houdini and then keep in mind we're still on the beta status so most of the things is not working the link that i show you guys or the website that i already showing you guys which is going to be this one here i'm going to be leave that link for you guys in the description down below that's going to be giving you a lot of information and also is going to be giving you a heads up about which one or which app you can go ahead and download it right now which is going to be available for that moment in the near future if there is more apps will be available i will be making sure to update you guys and then post another video to tell you about which one is working and how is that work so that's it for today's video and i hope you guys enjoyed today's video and i catch you guys with the next one peace